Good morning, Golden Ride. Travesty here, and today we have a special showdown session for you guys for your Saturday Night Slam. Now, joining me here today is going to be a special guest. You guys may know him by many names. He might be known as the bulkiest man on Golden Rod, and he's also the only fairy type, actually, if you think about it. It's the one and only Bulky Cotton Candy. Oh, kill him, yas! How's it going, guys? Bulky Cotton Candy here. All right, guys, and today, 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 we are going to be going into YouTube. I actually want to say that I'm the bulkiest man on YouTube. He is the bulkiest man on YouTube. You guys know this. You guys have seen the video. You guys have seen the duo lock and all that other stuff. So you know Skylar here very well if you guys are watching this video. He's even laughing, thinking back to the memories. <laughs> no, poor hives. No, it <laughs> <laughs> poor highs, poor highs. Hey man, he, he came back into the uh, soul link, man. He came back into it. Nobody caught him. He got bodied, but you know, he was, he was there. He was there in spirit. <laughs> now, for this real quick, guys, we are going to be rocking a UU team where you're going to be using the same exact team. So real quick, as you know, I like to do in these videos right here. Uh, we are actually going to go ahead and do a quick recap on the team. I actually built this team right here. So this is not... Uh, anything to do with him so if this team sucks you guys can't blame Skylar you gotta put all the heat onto me I only suck at duo locks he only sucks at duo locks showdown is his exception he is good to go and anything else as long as he's not <laughs> duo lock <laughs> he's good I'm only good in the little cup <laughs> he's good in the little cup man his munch latch is something of legends so without further ado the fact that that trick room team gets bodied <laughs> So without further ado guys, let's go ahead and go through our team. We First of all, we have Fred Durst, the Don fan. If you guys don't catch the reference, then you guys are not rolling, 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 rolling. Ah! Uh, unfortunately, he's not rocking Rolla. We were rocking him as our self rock, rapid spin, ice shard, earthquake U. So he is adamant. So he is going to be able to eat up that hit and body something in return. He also has defensive stats and HP. So he's pretty powerful as well. Uh, next off, we've got Roshi, who is the Mian Shao. He's rocking Life Orb, Regenerator. He's got Knockoff, High Jump Kick, U Turn, and Drain Punch. Uh, I decided on to using Drain Punch just because I was looking at it and I was like, you know what? You know what suits him? Not Fake Out. We're not going to put Fake Out on this mod. Uh, and next we've got our nice and lovely Thought. It's the Neighborhood Thought. You guys all know this lovely young lady. It is the Gudra. It's Assault Vest. It is Gooey with Dragon Pulse, Ice Beam, Thunderbolt, and Flamethrower. It is Modest with 252 EV in Special Attack. So this thing is going to be able to start bodying things. And it's also going to be eating out all the hits. Next we got Ace, the Darmanitan. It's Choice Scarf with Cheer Force, Flare Blitz, U-Turn, Super Power, Earthquake. This thing is going to be able to body things. It's adamant. It's got over 400 attack with full investment. So it's going to be a powerful thing. Next, to kind of switch things up, we got Neji, the nice and powerful Lucario. This thing is Life Orb with Inner Focus so nobody can be flinching us. We ain't weak. We are not trying to play any games here. This thing is Aura Sphere, Flash Cannon, Nasty Plot, Shadow Ball. This thing is powerful. This thing, if people do not know what this Lucario is going to do, it can absolutely be devastating. It's also timid, so this thing is a fast little bugger as well. And then we have Comets. The Mega Blastoise with Mega Launcher is rocking the Aerosphere, Dark Pulse, Hydro Pump, and Ice Beam, and it's modest as well, so this thing is going to be putting out the damages. So, without further ado, uh, Bulky, do you mm -hmm. want to find our first battle or you want me to do it? How do we, who, That is up to you. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and start up our first battle then. Bulky is going to... How this is going to work is Bulky is going to turn around and he's going to watch our battle and he's going to talk with us as we're going through it and then the next battle will be his and I'll do a battle and then Bulky will actually end off the episode. So without further ado, let's go ahead and look, look for a UU battle. Let's see what we get. I'm excited. I am excited. Ah. As it is searching right now. It is searching so hard right now. It's searching for that one person that's going to get the most. forever. And we got a team. We got a battle. Uh, this person's got a sticky web set up with... He's got sticky web and Dawn fan, so he has two possible leads. Uh, if he goes for the... Sticky web. You know what? I think it would not be a bad idea for me to actually lead off with Don Fan here. 
because if he goes with Garvantula, which usually when people set up Sticky Web, I can just go for a safe Earthquake. Yeah. And even if it's carrying the Energy Ball, if it doesn't go for it first turn, I'm completely fine. So mm -hmm. I'm just going to lead off with Don Fan. As he is going to lead off with his Galvantula. So I can actually just Earthquake here, I believe. Yeah, Galvantula does outspeed you, but I mean... I have Ice Shard. This is true. So I can literally... Yeah, he's going to Energy Ball right here. I'm sturdy. 30. So go for the Ice Shard. And it's Life Orb, so that thing's Never dead. Mind. It, what? It's Life Orb? <laughs> what? Alright, well... Fred Durst just rolled out on this fool. Um, now I don't. Uh, I have enough speed to actually outspeed the Swampert, so I could take this moment to go for a Stealth Rock here. Do I want to? Uh, um, I mean, do you really need Dawn Fan for anything on his team? You have Blastoise for his Dawn Fan and Arcanine. Um, the Porygon Z Mianxiao. The Swampert. You can deal with that with. Uh, what do you have for Swampert? Uh. Nothing really. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's a problem. Um, and then. Uh, for Reuniclus, you can basically just use Darmanitan and probably the rest of your team as well. Yeah, and Neji deals so, with it too. So I think Stealth Rock is the best play. I think Stealth Rock is your best play because you don't really need Dawn Fan for anything. So he sets up the Rain Dance, which I'm actually completely fine with here. Yeah, he gets the Swift Swim, but it's whatever. I'm just going to go for the Ice Shard here. Yeah, uh, get you off. I just want to get off as much damage as I possibly can. It's 13%. It's not bad. He goes for the Earthquake. Uh, let's see. He's definitely packing Ice Punch here. I would He go... outspeeded me, too. So that means he's got to be... Well, he uh... has Swift Swim. No, but he went for Rain Dance before I went for Stealth Rock. He outspeeded. Oh, so that means he has Speed Investment. So that means he is not packing the bulkier set of Swamper. He's more than likely rocking Jolly. Uh, which means... Me and I Shell could, without speed. I could go for Darmanitan. Darmanitan is Choice Scarf, and you turn out and go into comments. But also Lucario. But I'll catch um, an earthquake. Oh, true. So I think I think going into Darmanitan and you turning out with Choice Scarf is probably Are you my better speed? play. Oh yeah, you're Choice Scarf. Yeah, I think that's my better play, because that's going to bait him into uh, going for something that wouldn't really work on Blastoise. He goes for- Wow, he outspeeds? Even though I'm Choice Scarf? Alright, well, I've just made a misplay. Okay. He's- th Then in that case, he's gotta be max speed. Yeah, he's max speed. He's obviously- He's jolly max speed, then. That's the only thing I can think of. So what I'll do is I'll go into my Mega Blastoise here, and... I think I should just go for Ice Beam. Yeah. Or what would do the most damage, honestly? Well, Ice Beam... I don't mount speed, so it's pointless for me to go for a Do you a want flinch. to try to get him flinch and go for Dark Pulse? He'll be faster. Oh, true. I could go for Hydro Pump, but it is neutral. Yeah, this is true. I'm this going for true. it. I'm going for it. I'm a man. Oh, that, that crit, crit mattered. Oh my gosh. That crit mattered so much. But I got rid of a threat. I should have just gone out of the comments right off the get go. I mean, at least you got rid of it. Yeah, I did. So much damage. So, I imagine... I don't know what he would want to go into here. Because none of his posts are really going to outspeed me. Unless it... Oh, Arcanine will, actually. Well, Arcanine's got extreme speed, so... It would outspeed. Do I want to save my comments, Please. then? But you're okay because you can just go into um, Gudra once it goes down. Yeah, so I'm just gonna go for a Hydro Pump here. He's Heat Wave. Oh my god, the throw. <laughs> oh my god, the throw. He has Heat Wave Arcanine. Why does he have a Heat Wave Arcanine? <laughs> like, no, 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 no. Like, seriously, like, girl. girl what? I don't what? 
All right, all right. Well, the rain is up, so Hydro Pump isn't going to body every single thing. I could go for Aura Sphere here. Do it. Like, he's more than likely... Okay, you try attack. attacks here. All right. He's That's leftovers. Fine. I would go into Mian Shao and you turn out, and then go into Lucario. That's what I was about to say. Like, I could go into Lucario straight out if I want to, or I can go into Mian Shao, fake the high jump kick. Mm-hmm. And then you turn out into whatever. And the thing is, if he switches into Reuniclus, you're good to go. But if I go... Ooh, yeah, that's true. I'm on into Mian Chao. He tanks to hit. That's fine. I'm on into Neji here. Lock on, what? <laughs> Watch out for that uh, Fissure. Or... I'm, I'm, I'm just going happens. nasty plot here. Zap cannon! That's oh my all, god! That's why he did the lock on. I should have switched. I should have known. You are going to outspeed though. Oh wait, no you're not. No, the paralyze. Yeah, yeah, that was big. That was huge, actually. So I believe my best bet is to, I could actually just go for a drain punch here. I believe. <laughs> I, I don't want to really risk, I want to see if he has to protect at all. Is he going to go for the reunion place? So I can knock it have... off. I can you knock get... it off. Oh, true. It... Oh, it's burned now. That's, that's, which that's completely fine. Knock off will still kill it. Why would he have flame on though? Uh, I guess to work with magic guard. I don't know. Maybe it's a. Oh, I bet it's a uh, switch set or something like that. Then, because doesn't it get a uh, freaking switcher uh, switcheroo or something like that? Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Um, but here I can literally just. Right, it's sturdy. Is broken. I can go for a knockoff here. Get rid of its item. He's going to Earthquake yeah. my Roshi, and then that's dead. Pulse should take it out. I can just go for Ice Beam, actually. Oh, true. Yeah, so it, this this is, should be GG. His Ice Shard will not kill Gudra. If he packs yeah, it. Okay. Looking at the makeup of his team, that's like... I don't even... I think this might be an offensive Don Fanta. I don't know if this is even a rocker. Just because you, I don't know. It's weird having to Don Fan and Galvantula there. Like, and he waited so possible long possible to leads. send Don Fan out. Yeah, he has two possible leads, and then he waited so long to send his Don Fan out. Mm -hmm. Like he actually had opportunities to send that in. Because Don Fan defensively is, I believe, one uh, twenty base defense. So it's a really good defensive mon. I mean, he could go for the prediction here if he really wants to and switch into Porygon, but it's not going to do him anything but wear down his Porygon. He just has to set the Donphan and hope his Porygon can live a D-Pulse. Even then, though, my Gudra is freaking Assault Vest, and it has a base... Without me even touching its Spadef, it's 336 Spadef. Like, before Assault Vest... <laughs> <laughs> like, he's, he's, God forbid you put an assault vest on that thing. That should be illegal. Like, oh my god. Assault vest creatures should be ubers. Like, dude. <laughs> assault vest creatures. Oh my god. And I mean, with it being modest and full investment, that's 350 special attack. That's not bad. Like, it's a bulky monster that hits really hard. This guy's got 40 seconds. He's just letting the timer run out. And he, the, he can't do anything. Come on, dude. He left. <laughs> left. Okay. So he forfeited. Yeah, he forfeited. All right. So yeah, there was no way he was gonna win that though. Mhm. Mm All right, man. So whenever you are ready, let me know. Actually, Dragon Pulse. I just ran the Calc would not have uh would not have killed. But I don't think his Porygon Z would have killed me. I believe I would yep. have been able right. to bulk up through a hit. All right. I'm gonna start looking for a bow. Alright, tell me when you got one. 
Nice and searching. Yeah, nice and searching. Okay, we got one. Nice, uh, nice, nice. Butter meal. Not bad, butter meal. Uh, Salamence, Absol, uh, definitely Garvantula lead, Empoleon, Trevenant, and Infernape. Looking at the makeup of his team, I mean that Galvantula is definitely another sticky web team. Mm -hmm. uh, that's definitely got to be a Mega Absol, so you have to be careful about setting up rocks with that thing around. Uh, he has two possible leads, and well, he has three possible leads: an Empoleon, Galvantula, and Infernape. If he wants to yeah. lead fake out. Uh... He'd also defog with Empoleon. Yeah, he absolutely has it. So, I don't know, Donphan seems reasonable here as a lead. I mean, he deals with Especially Garbantula. Especially with the Sturdy, I can live anything and get up rocks. Yeah, like, you have that option. So I think that might be your best bet. Let's do it. As he goes he for the Trevenant. Trevenant. All right. I should. Well, I it won't. I... It won't kill. It won't do enough damage, I believe. Um, if only we were Sap Sipper <laughs> Uh, let's see. You could. If he you goes for Grass type and then a turn. What does Donphan really do well against besides Infernape? Not much, really. Not much, really. And you don't want him to become farther to the Salamence with the Motsi. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. Uh, I believe you could set up your rocks here if you want to. Empoleon is going to be annoying, though. So you have to watch out for that. But... Yeah. I'm just going to rocks. I'm going to set up rocks. Yeah, he's on Horn Leech. That doesn't even two-hit, two-shot kill. Like... Yeah, it doesn't even two-shot. So rocks, and I'm just going to Ice Shard. Yeah, you can literally just Ice Shard here. Yeah, did... Phantom Force, really? You can switch oh. out. You could switch out on this if you... Well, no, you don't have a normal type. I was about to say, oh my god. <laughs> um, let's see. But... Who's the most offensive mom on the team? Phantom Force is physical, right? Yeah, Phantom Force is physical. This is a physical Trevenant. I don't see why he be going for a physical trevenant i'm slower than this trevenant that so is... honestly i'm gonna live this i should live this fan of course and then i think my best bet would be to eq well because it's the only thing i can do yeah okay yeah you're gonna live that like yeah, yeah and, and then you can just ice shard, ice shard. yeah ice shard's gonna take him out wait he doesn't have harvest Alrighty then. He left. And he leaves. What? <laughs> what was that? I mean, okay. All right then. Yeah, I was about to. I mean, that that was a really weird Trevenant set. It was really weird that he even led with it because even even leading with it, Don Fan's defense is too high for Trevenant to touch. Yeah, I, th I find it really weird that he just didn't go for Horn Leech, maybe hoping for a high roll. Like, yeah, I, 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 feel, I find it really weird that he didn't go for Horn Leech again, just wanting to get a high roll. Alright, well, I, I guess it's my it's my turn. <laughs> Alright. Alright then. Uh, and I actually have a team already. Alright, so he has Mega Swampert, uh, Rotom Heat, Whoa, he has two potential Megalos. I think it's Mega Sceptile. Raw Sceptile is not a thing. Uh, Heliosk, Hatteras, and Runin. It was funny because I looked at the other side and I was like, wait, that's the same exact team. Wait, what? And I was like, oh, I'm watching from the His other side. His lead is probably Swampert. So I think it's. That's a rain setter, maybe. Yeah, so I believe I can just go. I kind of want to go Comets first or Ace and. Go for it. Go I think for it. I think going Darmanitan is actually a really good choice here because it's Choice Scarf, so I'm guaranteed to outspeed anything, and I can just U-turn out. Unless it's max speed. I'm high right now. It's this Pokemon. <laughs> <name. laughs> Alright, yeah, I can just U-turn it, yeah. I can U-turn it, and... And go into maybe... Maybe go into... 
No, you don't want to catch an earthquake. I don't know what you should go and do. I can just go in the comments, I think. I, yeah, I think that's your best bet. Because if he goes for a water type move, I'm going to eat it up. Mm, that earthquake, though. Yeah, and he hasn't mega so it's definitely Mega Sceptile. Yeah, so it's definitely Mega Sceptile. So oh, I can just faking it. At least I think I can just go for Hydro Pump here and kill it. Because I don't think it's speed invested. Oh, it lived! Oh, it's so close. It's bulky. It has to be bulky. Yeah, it's oh the bulky God. set. So, with that um, being said... I would go into Dawn Fan and Ice Shard should take it out. Should I Dawn Fan it or should I just go into Roshi and U-turn it? Because that's, li that's, that's Life Orb Regenerator. That's your choice. Um, I definitely think that uh, Ice Shard would take it out. I think so yeah if yeah i mean it is it's neutral it's 12 percent it is an adamant yeah I'll, I'll just go for it why not is that really don fan's cry oh my gosh yeah that's his cry <laughs> all right so he predicts it goes into the blue spirit i can just ice shard away here dude but if he megas it's for the, why Actually, I think I'm going to predict him to actually not stay in on this because he knows no, I have Ice Shard I now. Would, I, I would just Ice Shard and be safe, honestly. Because, yeah, he goes into Heliosk. I get Stealth Rocked up. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> um, He's going to go for Surf right here. So yeah, I think so I think going into Thought is a good choice. Yeah. Yeah, cause I look at that. Yes. <laughs> Tastes so good. Oh my god. So I can just D pulse here, and nothing wants this. Nothing wants yeah, this. Rotom like, Heat. That's not a counter. That was a bad. That was bad. That was a bad switch for him. That is not a counter. No, you're getting D pulse. Hidden power. Oh my god. Hidden <laughs> power ice. Hidden power ice. He has nothing to deal with this right now. I think Gujar might take the game. Like, he has he has nothing that can deal with it right now. Honestly, Gujar could take the game. Like, the only thing he can send in here is Hatsuris. Mm -hmm. But then again, then again, even... Why? This is not a counter! Flamethrower! Why? Even, uh, even if he Megas, Flamethrower... I'm Ice Beaming. Because if he Mega Evolves, he's going to take times four. Times I, I, I don't know really this set, this Gujar all that well. <laughs> The Discoudra is the the thought, dude. <laughs> That's it, I'm naming my Gudra thought now. <laughs> oh my god, what is he thinking here? Like, I understand he outspeeds me. And if he's a physical set, it's not. Is he not Mega? He is Mega, but he probably didn't Mega evolve because he thought that that would give him the Dragon Pulse. Oh, I see what you did there. He thought. Yeah, he thought. <laughs> So it's one of those things where it's just like, uh, and yeah, I can just go, I can go for another deep pulse right here. This is not a counter. No, that doesn't, that does nothing. That's not a counter. <laughs> I, I don't know what he's thinking. Like I can just deep pulse again. Look, look, that's a freaking thunderbolt. Lizard thing is gone now. That's a stab thunderbolt too. Yeah, this thing is taking out three of his mons. Swag. He sends out his swag. It's not a counter. It's not a counter. Oh my god, you got critted. Signal me! <laughs> what? <laughs> I mean, I guess for dark types. Uh, it, it's, it's, a... it's a roll. Oh my gosh. This. <laughs> oh, it's Mold Breaker. You know what? You know what? I'm staying in. Dragon Pulse. Dragon Pulse. Let's Dragon Pulse. Come on. Set up on me. Set up on me. Okay. <laughs> you yeah, lose speed. Just the Dawn fan and Ice Shard. Yeah, I can just Ice Shard this thing to death now. I I win. Like, <laughs> like he can't. What's he gonna do? Dragon Dance on me? Go for it. Swords Dance? Go for it. You have no priority. You're slow. Ed Scissor? Ed Scissor? <laughs> oh. This this dude's catching. I'm now. He's I'm catch. Tapped. He's catching hands at this moment in time. 
Like poison jab. I understand poison jab. I can understand. Yeah, I that. understand that, but why would you go for it? Like it. He, why are you not going for your stab move? Why is he not move? going for stab? Yeah, why is he not going for stab? No matter what, stab is going to do the most damage. Like honestly, honestly, thought was the MVP of this. Like no joke. Like yeah, thought and Fred Durst, dude. Thought and Fred Durst put in the absolute finest amount of work in this match. Yeah, and Ice Shard wins you the game. Yeah, Ice Shard just wins. Like, it all came down to the fact that he <laughs> freaking <laughs> Gutra. <laughs> GG. Uh -huh. Alright, oh I'm looking for a battle. Alright, tell me what you got, one. Wow. Dude, that match. <laughs> Dude, I'm telling you, Assault Fest Gudra is so good. It really is. It really is. Assault Gudra. Okay, we got a match. Oh! It's the same guy! It's the same guy! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, no, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm leading for a Durst. I'm leading for a Durst. Oh my god. He's going to, he's going to go with Swampert as his lead. Mm -hmm. And I'm, did you Stealth Rock first? Uh, no, I actually led with Darmanitan last match. That's true. I, actually, what you probably should have done is just lead off with uh, Blastoise, because we know it outspeeds it, and just double Hydro Pump and this thing would die. <laughs> should I switch? Uh, no, because remember so how much Earthquake did. Yeah, I would say... Uh, you could probably just go for your rocks here, because rocks yeah. are not a friend to his team. Ice yeah. Punch, yeah. Oh, oh, <laughs> no, Red Durst is on ice. That really sucks. Yeah, so Fred Durst is basically done, though. I mean, I'm just gonna click Salt Rocks again. Yeah, yeah, that's all you can do. Alrighty then, comics, come on out. Yeah, <laughs> you can right, just so Mega Hydro. Yeah, just Mega Hydro, it's neutral. Unless you miss, that's the worst possible thing that can happen. He's gonna go into Helios, which is the actual proper switch in. It's what? It's not dry really? skin? It's solar power. It is solar power. I'm not gonna outspeed this thing. Yeah, you're not. You can just go into Gudra though. Alright, here we go again. <laughs> Shit, I mean it's just <laughs> <laughs> It's just a, a ten <laughs> Um, let's see. No one, no one on his team wants to take a drag Dragon Pulse. Honestly, nothing on his team's going to take it. Well, like you can just go stab Dragon Pulse. I mean, look at that. He's fucking going for Focus Blast here. I'm surprised he even hit it. Oh my I think god. From now on, I can just click D Pulse. Uh, uh, okay, ice no. Beam. No, just hit Ice Beam here. Because if he Megas, yeah, there's the Mega. Yeah, there's the Mega. He Dragon Pulse Megas, and he's dead. Ice beam five. <laughs> Me sending Hatteras. <laughs> it goes back at the Swampert. Like, hi again. <laughs> uh, D Pulse? Yeah, like, it's. it's okay, right, so, so Ice Punch. Ice punch yeah, but his speed is dropped. You can literally go into Comets now if you wanted to. Or you could. Yeah, you can go into Comets right now and just freaking. Hydro pump again. <laughs> you can hydro pump, you can dart pulse, you can do whatever you want right now. Look at this. Oh, I'm Wait, dark pulse. This is that. Th this is not a counter. Dark pulse it, please. Are you Urus? I, I clicked the wrong move. I clicked the wrong move. That was my bad. I clicked the wrong move. Just dart pulse it now, and yeah, this thing's dead. Whoa. Blueberry. Nothing. <laughs> you dark pulse again and it's dead. Like <laughs> that was my bad on the Or Sphere. <laughs> or Sphere, that was something of legend. All right, I don't so that's not a switch. He's tricking you. <laughs> that's not a switch. He tried to trick you. You can't trick me. <laughs> he tried to trick you. What? What is this? Okay, no. What I really want to know is this guy's thought process. Oh my god, this isn't a counter either. You can just ice, ice beam. beam it. Yeah. If only we had ice pulse. Oh, ice pulse. Mega launcher boosted ice pulse. 
At scissor, why did he not go That's for not your a... shit? Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, you can just... So he had a... Oh, wow. He got the what? higher roll. I oh, no, 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 yeah, it was the same roll, never mind. So oh, yeah, you could, but you could literally just go into freaking your Lucario if you want to and kill this thing. You can go into Lucario, you have Darmanitan, you have Minshaw. Like, his Swampert's at 58%. I would just go yeah. Lucario, honestly. Yeah. And... Flash Cannon. It's my only... S well, I could go for Aura Sphere, and it doesn't miss. So yeah. I'm just gonna go for Aura Sphere. Yeah. And then this, you know you outspeed the Swampert right here, so you can just literally yeah. go for another Aura Sphere. This thing's gonna eat it up, but it's gonna die in its turn. Hammer, Hammer arm. arm, okay. I mean, I can honestly go out into Darmanitan and just U-turn. Yeah, and it's dead. Because he does not want to take that. Like, yeah, that's dead. Alright! So oh, we... right! So we faced the same guy twice, but... <laughs> we end it with a... Did we lose at all? No, we didn't. Oh my god, we are Actually, hashtag we had flawless. Two forfeits. We had two forfeits, and we had we same each had a twice. match with the same guy. <laughs> oh my god. It's funny. I find that really funny that we found the same guy, because I was looking at his team, I was like, this looks so way a second. <laughs> so, without further ado, guys, uh, this has been a... This is this our is Saturday the Slam episode night. Of the Saturday Night Slam. This is, this is Saturday Night Slam. But okay, no, no. From now on, we have to name every Pokemon like John uh, Cena, Randy Orton, oh Brock Lesnar. We have to go from with the wrestling on. names. All right. Well, next time you guys see it, we're gonna be into Super Slam. And we're going to be uh, seeing you guys again next week. And be sure to, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button. Drop a subscription down to Goldenrod today. We are have the finest broadcasters in all of Johto. All over the land, actually. We got people, Pokemon from all over the place. So be sure to check out. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to uh, Bulky here for joining me today. Be sure to tell subscribe him. Subscribe to Trav. He has uh, nice eyes, and his battling skills are subpar and all that good stuff. And we will see you guys next week. Bye!